And here go the boys, Division 4 CF Southern Section Championship race. Once again, just like all of our races except for the girls of Division 5, so 17 will qualify. And we can do, this is unofficial until it is confirmed by the CF office, but we had West Torrance easily our winner by 60 points. West Torrance, the winner of the Division 3 Southern Section Championship with 87. And then very close here, Santa Margarita second at 147. And then Capel Valley and St. John Bosco at 149. Looks like Capel Valley has the better sixth runner. So they'll finish in that third, St. John Bosco fourth. Gray Olinda fifth at 162. Sixth, a girl, 179. And right now, Dos Pueblos moves on to the state meet at 192. Isaiah Gibbons, the winner, will be an individual in the state meet. Jared Steins of Servite. Will Perk of Palos Verdes. And then it looks like Jordan Galindo of Savannah and Luke Stefano of Palos Verdes. That would be five individuals. So individuals move on if they are in the top five individuals on non-qualifying teams, provided they're in the top 20, but that's five in the top eight. So congratulations on West Torrance, our first Southern Section Cross Country Champion. And our leaders very quickly through the first 400 meters in 64 seconds. And girls division three, the race scheduled to begin about 8.35. Coaches should be over at the clergy course. The clergy course will let us know if we move back up to get up back on schedule. But right now, just about 10 minutes behind on that schedule. So girls division three should be going about 8.35. Could go a little bit earlier if we get everything on target there. Clergy of course will keep us uh, abreast of what's going on. So a great first championship race. Congratulations to West Torrance, the Division Three Southern Section champions. Heading up to Fresno, leading that group. So they're in a great battle with Camp Alindo next weekend, California State Meet, the finest high school state meet in the country, without a doubt. Next Saturday up at Woodward Park in Fresno, but we've got nine Southern Section champions to crown here. Once again, the first two teams will see Flats Day, top 15 individuals, and the winner of the race gets a special award. Let's go, Camilo! Let's go, Hawks! Stay with them, stay Let's with go, them. Hawks! Let's go! Let's go, Jayla! Let's go, Diego! Let's go, Brandon! Let's go, Lucas! Let's go, Hawks! And here comes our lead pack. Right around 4.50 through the mile. Sanders of Big Bear in there, Camille Torres of Fillmore, Sheehy of Harvard-Westlake, Alvarez of LaSalle and Goodell of Wilson. 
but that's just that lead pack, and it really isn't much of a gap. And Max Sanders had an outstanding invitation here. He ran 14.48, was the second fastest time of the day in the invitation this year to win that. He is committed, he's a senior committed to the Air Force Academy, and he is making a move here, heading up, and he has opened up, oh my gosh, in just the little distance of the switchback hills, he's opened up about 10 meters. Sheehy of Harley Westlake in second. Camille Torres of Fillmore right there in third. And Alvarez of LaSalle. That's our top four. Fastest time of the day so far, 1448. And so again, that is what Santa Fe in the Invitational about a month ago here at the end of Division Four sweepstakes. The senior out of Big Bear having a great senior year, leading our Division Four Boys Championship race. And there he is. You can see him now. He's made his way across the top of the switchbacks, and he has expanded that lead to about 20 meters now. But a very close group, looks like about 10 boys within about 10 meters of each other. Now they're starting making their way around the banner. It's about a half mile downhill to the mile and a half to the halfway point. Right when they're coming into the big safe Southern Section 4 championship banner at the bridge. And they hit that for a halfway. Girls Division 3 should be heading over to the clerk of the course.
I see him. I see him right here. Right at 1009. 1009 for Santa. Let's go, Hawks! At the two on, mile boy. mark, we're going to set 15 boy. pace. Work together, Hawks! And now, this is our Let's unofficial go. quick score at the halfway point. Cathedral 105. Laguna Hills, 140. El Segundo, 162. St. Francis, fourth at 167. Big Bear, fifth at 169. Harvard Westlake, sixth, 174. Orange Lutheran, seventh at 190. South Pasadena, just five back at 195. Wilson, just three back at 198. And then Foothill Tech at 228. Once again, top seven teams will move on to the state meet no. right now no. in seventh, eighth, and ninth. Those teams separated by less than seven points. Cathedral, though, halfway through, is our leader right there with Laguna Hills. They're the top two teams in this division going in. Cathedral second in this race in 2019, and now they're making their way along the back of Reservoir. And just a reminder, so the top two teams will receive their awards once they announce that the results are official. They do check everything to make sure everything is right. And those will be at the CF area that by the big green building up there on that grass field. Once again, awards today, the top 15 individuals are getting awards as they come through the finish line area. Top two teams, and the winner of each race also gets a special award. The big award, though, is seven teams moving on to the California State Cross Country Championships next Saturday at the Woodward Park. Continues to expand upon that lead. He is in control. What a great year. He won the Fastback Invitational here. That is a two-mile race done here the very first week of the season. And here we are in the last week of the season on his way to try to win a championship. Then you can see very close. Two, three, four, five, six boys in those spots. Like Sauter of uh, Girls Ridgecrest is leading that Let's group. Go, Let's go, Manny! You got this, buddy. <laughs> Let's go, get it! Let's go, get it! Look at it! Let's go, get it! Open it up, girl! Let's go, get it! Let's go, get it! And we coach the 1330. And here he comes on in the air stud, Max Sanis, a big man. The senior formerly in control right at 14 minutes. He just gets that lead larger and larger. And he Let's has about 350 meters to go Gio. to a CF championship. Sarder, uh, girls of Ridgecrest leading that group. And then a great battle here, Mr. Perez, in the light of Cathedral. Others of Lasalle. She trying to move up in Camille Torres. A great battle there. Cathedral with two in the top ten. Hernandez making a move, trying to get up in there. Goodell of Wilson holding on. Auburn Westlake looks like two in the top ten. Big Bear, two in the top 15. South Pass, two in the top 16. Laguna Hills, 
No one in the top 10, but three in the top 16. And four in the top 20. The good hills, the white top, and the yellow shorts. And Matt Sanders is our winner at 15 11. Sauter, you'll see Sauter at Bulls. 15 23. She of Harvard Wesley. Third, 15 26. Perez. Cathedral, 27. Alvarez, the South. 15 27. Torres, Gilmore, 15 34. Hernandez at Cathedral, 15 41. Eighth, Gabelle, the Hudson Ice. Wilson, 15 42. Nakamura, South Class, ninth, 15 44. Metcalf, St. Francis, 10th, 15 52. Benedict, Notre Dame, 15 53. Romero finishes 12th of El Segundo, 15 55. Same time for Sykes and Harvard Westlake in 13th. Royale of Laguna Hill, 15 58. And Pelletier of H. Christian, 16 01 in the 15th spot. And looking for the first team to get five across. We're still only at 16.30 on the clock at standing division four boys race. Max Sanders at Big Bear, the senior. What great year. Finishes off of the Southern Section Championship running 15-11. And Yassine Sarter in an outstanding field there finishes second at 15-23. Cathedral now has five across and so does Laguna Hills. This is going to be very close for the winner of that between Cathedral and Laguna Hills. And now Orange Lutheran with five across the finish line. And the race getting lined up will be girls division three. Scoring as runners top five, each school's top five comes through. That changes the scoring. But right now, waiting for all those runners to score, Pedro and Laguna is both with 29. So wait for that official result. Looking at that team score here in this great boys division four race. Looks like Laguna Hill separating a bit there. Most of the schools have their top five across. We'll wait on that final. But Laguna Hills and Cathedral, a great battle there for the top spot. And Harvard Westlake Big Bear, St. Francis, Wilson, South Pass, Burroughs, Ridgecrest, Foothill Technology, all very close. Going back to that Division Four boys race with Max Sanis off to Air Force in the fall, but your winner. Your top five early on here, McCorka doing the pacing up front, but Chavez, who's third in 2019, Rome, brand new to cross country this year from Yorba Linda right up there as well as the freshman from Santa Margarita, Sophie Collet, Elizabeth Statina, also of Sonora up there in that top five. Porco, she was 12th in 2019. Chavez again third made her way up to the state, both state meet.